Hello and welcome to Math 231 Calculus 1. I'm your instructor, Linda Green, and in this video I'm going to tell you how this course will be structured. In addition to myself, there are two TAs who will be staffing this course, Savannah Howard and Larissa Abdallah. They'll be leading recitations on Fridays and helping with grading. We'll also have several undergraduates who will be coming to class on Tuesdays and Thursdays to help answer questions. I'll introduce them to you as they arrive. This class meets for lecture twice a week on Tuesdays and Thursdays and for recitation once a week on Fridays. Before each lecture class, please check Canvas for instructions. Usually you'll be asked to watch one or two short videos and do a two or three question before class assignment on infinity so that you'll have some of the basics before we get to class. During class, you may want to take notes using the skeleton version of the notes that I post on Canvas ahead of time. I also post filled in notes after class so you can fill in what you miss. I'll also ask you to answer clicker questions using Poll Everywhere and to work problems with the students at your table. Please ask questions during class for the benefit of your classmates as well as yourself. After class is a good time to check Canvas for filled in notes, read the book, and work homework problems on the Infinity homework system. We'll be using an open source textbook called OpenStax Calc 1 as our primary textbook this semester, but you'll also be able to access two of my favorite traditional textbooks, uh, one by Stewart, that's my actual favorite, and Briggs, which we use in some of the other calculus classes, you'll be able to access portions of those online via the course reserves tab on Canvas or physical copies in one of the libraries. I think it's in Davis Library on Reserve. I encourage you to attend office hours and post questions on Piazza. During recitation, I'll ask students to work on problems in groups and upload one set of solutions per group onto Gradescope. We'll also have quizzes most every week, sometimes in recitation, but usually online on Gradescope. There are many sources of support for this class. We have a Math 231L class. This is an optional class that meets once a week and gives just-in-time review and instruction on pre-calculus topics needed for calculus. If you can't attend this or if it's full, you may want to consider an online self-study course using Alex. Details are on the syllabus. Some semesters we also have a Math Plus study group offered by the Learning Center. You can go to office hours for any Math 231 instructor. Piazza will have a list of all the office hours on as a pinned post and you can see my office hours on the syllabus. We may also have additional office hours offered by our undergrad learning assistants and our graduate student TAs. I'll post these on Piazza also if we end up having them. There's a few places you can get tutoring. There's the Math Help Center in Phillips, peer tutoring in Die Hall. Both of these also may offer some online options. And there's a private tutor list posted on the math department website. The private tutor list is for pay, but the first two options are free, so you might as well take advantage of them. Please see the syllabus for more details on all these options. In this course, I want to encourage you to make use of resources that will help you learn. For homework, in-class problems, recitation problems, before class assignments, you're welcome to use books and calculators. Uh, it's also fine for you to use computational engines like Wolfram Alpha to check your answers and try to pinpoint your algebra mistakes, but please don't use them to actually solve the problems <laughs> from the get-go because that won't help you learn. Collaboration with other students is encouraged. The collaboration should benefit the learning of all involved, so if you're simply copying or trading answers, looking up answers, that would be a violation of the honor code. On quizzes and tests, the rules are a little different. Collaboration is not allowed. Those are individual assignments. They are closed book and closed notes unless otherwise specified. And for quizzes and tests that are in class, calculators are not allowed. For the online take-home quizzes, calculators will be allowed, but that'll be specified clearly on the quiz and in class. If you're ever in doubt about what's permitted on assignment, please ask. 
And if you're ever aware of a violation of the honor code, please bring it to my attention so I can bring it to the honor court. There's more information about how the class works on the syllabus, which is on the Canvas site. If you have questions, please post them on Piazza or bring them to class on the first day. See you in class.